the Mariana Trench is one of the most mysterious places on the planet. The average depth of the ocean is around 12,100 feet. The deepest part of the ocean is called the Challenger Deep, and is located beneath the western Pacific Ocean in the southern end of the Mariana Trench. Challenger Deep is approximately 36,200 feet deep, so with this knowledge we should keep an open mind about what could be lurking at the bottom of the ocean. A few years back a mysterious noise was recorded coming from the Mariana Trench, however this sound was later identified to be a new type of baleen whale call. What's odd is that no one had heard this call before, and people are questioning why the whale was doing this. Some have put forward the theory this call was a distress call, and that the whale may have encountered something down there. One theory that's been put forward is that an ancient plesiosaur could be down there. Plesiosaurs first appeared in the late Triassic period around 203 million years ago. These ancient sea creatures had very sharp teeth and incredibly strong jaws. This allowed them to not only feed on fish of all sizes, but also any other swimming animal that may have been in the ocean at the time. Their strong jaws and sharp teeth may have allowed them to eat mollusks that live along the prehistoric shoreline. This creature is characterised by their long necks, sleek bodies, small heads and wide flippers. Despite their sleek bodies, plesiosaurs were far from being the fastest marine reptiles of the Mesozoic era. One place where these creatures are said to live is in Loch Ness in Scotland. The Loch Ness monster has been sighted for hundreds of years, and when you see reconstructions of plesiosaurs they do look similar to people's description of the Loch Ness monster. The oceans are vast, dark and deep so somewhere somehow a colony of plesiosaurs might have survived. Vast regions of the world's oceans remain to be explored, and it doesn't defy belief that a living plesiosaur may one day be discovered. Cryptozoologists say that after the mass extinction a group of these predators started heading into deep waters. However, although these theories sound incredible there's no evidence to back them up. Eyewitness accounts are great but sometimes we can misidentify modern creatures. This is thought to explain most of the strange sightings that people have. So what do you guys make of this theory? Do you think there's an extinct creature living at the bottom of the Mariana Trench? Let me know your thoughts in the comments. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.